What's up guys? Welcome back. We're playing Spain. Uh, in between recordings here, I've made up my mind. Uh, we are going to build up an army. Uh, probably two armies actually. Um, once this all goes. So my ships go in here right now. Group you guys up. Let's deal with these rebels. And go back in here. Detach. Go over there. We're going to be mothballing the majority of our forts for the time being. What we will also do is see, we got 20,000 troops over here, right? And 35 in this region that have 10 cannons, which is okay. We got 27, 21,000 troops and 26. So, we can still grow this one army. Because I believe the combat width right now is still, yes, 27. We don't use mercs. And we can build up a crap ton of troops. So, let's go. We need more money. You know, let's take a loan. Not that bad. Let's take a loan. Let's build that army. Uh, let's go two more. And... 21 two good size armies then you are back in your ships go here and drop them off there he won't attack me because he just does not have the troops and the global tariffs they have they have increased now all of my all of my vessels, they are just in a, the worst possible position. They are spiraling out of control. Let's keep exploring the rest here while we build up those colonies. And once we take all of it, because we can actually go here. Go here, take this land and start declaring on these guys like Jeden all the way down to korea as long as they're not like we could become a tributaire i think i don't think i don't know how but we'll i think we can get that once we're there and uh, we can declare war on all of the tributaires take all of that and have some fun with it uh, currently, I'm just hoping, and there's another colony, let's go here, so that's him, where's trade, trade is there, so, oh, 9,000, oh, that's sick, okay, how many troops can I still build? Let's go with five and we'll build okay that that's not working like that do one two three four something like that so two good size armies Going into Spain, or actually going into England, is there nothing we cannot convert? No, apparently not. Well, it's fine. No hidden missions anymore that I've clicked and never did anything with. Liberty Desire, is that actually a thing with us? There's a tiny bit here in Cuba where he's just being annoying. Also, we need to start investing into our trade companies uh, because we can make a lot more troops um, by just going at trade. Go here. Um, wrong. Go here. Uh, good production. Local development cost. I, I don't know if I care about that. Naval force limit plus 5. We get the land force limit plus 5. 
trade steering plus 50 that's not as powerful as i once thought yearly army tradition plus 0.03 we can get some really good generals from that uh, i want to be focusing afterwards on trying to get through the mamluks into a position where we can go and have some fights in this region uh, while taking Africa. So we'll stop conquest in Europe. Yeah, we'll stop conquest in Europe. We'll build him up. We don't need both armies, right? My army did manage over there. He is making the crossing. How damn brave are you? He's very brave. Dense. Densely brave. Let's go. Now we just detach. And can we send you over there? No, over here then. And you go over there. Let's get Scotland back. Piecing him out. And by that time, my army here should be done. And they are. One more troop remaining. Uh, four and a half years is a bit too much for me. But we're going to be growing Scotland mighty, mighty fine. And high and large and beefy. And all of those words that just pop into mind. Making a good amount of money though, I like that. So, we'll get a Aztec Catholic, improve relations, a conquistador or prestige. Let's go for the prestige because we did abdicate our son uh, since we're 17, so it doesn't really matter, right? Uh, explore next coastal regions and I think the exploration is almost done. And maybe expansion would not be such a bad idea. Let's move everyone together. So let's go move you over there. And we can hide our troops indoors. Another damn revolt in Byzantium. Yeah, this is the very first guy that I'm going to integrate because he's so damn annoying. And vassalizing the Ottomans here. Yeah, I would like that. There's my ships. Where's that one unit? Um. Hmm. Where is that one unit? Why? Why there? Why in Portuguese territory? And this should be enough to deal with the English. Okay, let's group you guys up. Then afterwards, we're going to be sending one of my uh, armies into Africa. Okay, so this is done. Uh, we'll go for culture conversion cost because we do have some missions here in the severe note we're going to be pressing this one culture conversion cost and same goes for you and we're going to be transforming these guys into castilian 
Castilian. Castilian. Now, luckily, because we have been um, expelling minorities, this is actually not as expensive as it used to. I think it's these... This one as well. Let's see. Yeah, this one as well. Okay, so this would actually finish the mission once that's all done. Uh, call for peace. Yeah, that will happen, mate. Once my armies get there. So, once again, vassalization. Nobody actually cares anymore. Drop your money. You're now my vassal. And we can now declare war. Uh, for the reconquest of all of this territory. Austria, Holland, Liege, everyone. But England could also just declare war on us. Uh, I kind of don't necessarily want to fight all of these. But I do need to kick England's ass. And grow Scotland. And he would be a lot more happy. No debt. That's that's one thing. There's no debt. Can and Burgundy neither. Burgundy is fighting friends. Once that war is done, he would be interesting. I think to join. How is um, Russia doing? He's just too far away to actually care about this. So, let's get an army in my ships. We'll go here. And uh, we're going to have a lot of wars here. Because I'm sick and tired of it. Uh, I want territory. So, gain 50 admin. And I'm... Should I? No, we're going to be developing. Definitely developing. Uh, we know there's a gold mine. Yearly prestige plus one. Yeah, that, that's not a, that expensive. There's a gold mine in here. So, let's do one admin. Oh, we just don't have the diplo. Okay, well, that's good to know. Should have checked that beforehand, but that's fine. Uh, we'll leave this guy. Where? 29. No, once you're done, you're going home. There is no point. I don't want to fight all of them. As long as that guy is there. That's... We'll wait for a few years. Two few rivals, finally. Let's go with the Mamluks. And Denmark, because he rivaled me. Let us... We need to insult someone. So, let's insult England. Scornfully. Can we also insult... You scornfully. No, it doesn't really do anything. We're going to do for five, but that's just a waste. Issue embargo. And we'll do the same with the Memlux. Quarantine. Still making money. How's my um, stability here? So, it's not too good yet. Did they make it? Yes, they did. So, Bannon. Let's get my guys. Move over there.
declare war, show superiority. We'll call in Congo. And we can just walk over here. He <laughs> post check, man. <laughs> I know I look tired. I know I look tired, but it's it's in the middle of the night for me, mate. We'll uh, we'll live. Come on, just have that fight for me, please. Okay, detach for siege. Cannot go there. Go backwards. You won't attack me. Let's just um, you split. Uh, supply limit of 32 is not that bad. But welcome back, mate. How are you doing? Go there. I will take a large portion of this. Because there's trade in there and I want it. Just These guys will wait. Uh, there's Co uh, Congo's armies going in. Uh, we will definitely reinforce this. What's the supply limit? 26. Hmm. Yeah, we can all reinforce here if we need to. He's just sacking this. I hate that. Uh, agent was discovered here in Congo. Okay, we can't use it now. Can we steal maps from the Mamluks? Let's take a look. Um, global tariffs, no. I uh, don't need a conquistador and I kind of don't need a general, but this one is quite nice. And uh, we're now four on four. It has two siege pips, so that's quite nice. The first female general in, in my armies, so nice. Let us do something with my other troops here. Eventually he'll be happy. Not right now though. Go send you over there. And uh, we got a 3, 2, 4. Well, at least it's better than the last one. Uh, this one is at least having 9 points, so we'll keep him. And a revolt. Byzantium, Byzantium, what on earth are you doing? Can we attack you? Breaking truce, well, kind of don't want that. Uh, let's go for the legitimacy, because that would be strengthening our throne. Declaring on Poland would not be such a bad idea, actually. Hey, good night, mate. And good luck on your test tomorrow. 7 a.m. for a test. Jesus Christ. That's way too early, dude. Way too early. Come on now, take it. Come on, you can do this. Oh yeah, we're going to be looking if we can get some claims here. Like you. You. I think that is the majority of things. Well, not really. We need 40. But we can also just give this to the Byzantiums. That will actually fulfill some of their quests. Yeah, I'm not ready. I'm not done yet. Whoa, dude. Oh, that early in the morning and a test. That's just absolutely horrible. Okay, what we might do is send my trips over here. Because this is getting him nowhere. Move you over there. Let's see. Spain loses course and Portugal would like that. Let's do it. I take it. Yes, he did. You go there. You go there. 
You go here. You go there. Everyone go there. Okay, how many points can I get into this? 24. Let's deal with those trips. Uh, we get a negative one though, but they're just so much weaker. Uh, it's a wipe. So, detach. Go to the capital. He might go for those troops though. I think he is. Look at that. And we'll go after him. There you go. Where are those troops? Get this back. Okay, admin. Um, let's go get ourselves some money. That's more than enough. Finally making some money. I like it. So we'll get all of this back. That's regrettable. Apparently we had a fight? Yeah, we got some transports here. Go away. I want to get the coastal region here again. And if we can push onwards to Kilwa, then that would be absolutely fantastic. Two and a half years ahead of time still. Uh, we got one loan. Okay, my troops have arrived. Go over here. Let's go deal with those, those rebels. Yep, that's a nice fight for us to have. Uh, Byzantium itself is going to do the unseating, but we'll help him. And I'm actually considering taking the Ottomans as a, another vessel. No, I'm not. But I wouldn't mind attacking the Mamluks. Hmm, but do I want to start two fights at the same time? Again. Group you guys up. Get with that back. Head out over there. We'll probably fight a lot of natives along the way. And the attrition is no joke. Thatch. Oh, the Empress Consort Anna um, died very unexpected. Mm. Royal Marriage Scotland. We could just attack the Ottomans. With my main army over here. Okay. I think this is time that we get started on removing all of this. So that's three of them. And yeah, we can actually remove quite a bit of them. Can we do that right now? Yes, we can. Uh, one more for the clarity, though. So we could, should be getting more money again. Um, do whatever. Uh, let's explore. Uh, where's my army? You're over there. Oh. You go over there. Not now. And I'll do two more. I think... Ah, wrong bet. I could pull both of them off, actually. 
So we'll get a lot more absolutism and stuff like that. So let's grip. Let us go here. It's actually this fortress. This is a level 2. So we'll detach for siege. Apparently we did capture ships again. grow over there, detach and then immediately go and take this back he's locked in already so there's no way out yes uh, even though I do get the negative, we're just wiping the damn floor with them, which I like quite a bit um, no, we'll just wait over there until that siege is done uh, where's my other armies? England's been really, really nicely going with those um, colonies. That's why I would like to do colonial wars with him. Twenty-nine, thirty-five, forty-six. Go there. If I declare war on the Ottomans. Okay, I might have to do this really fast though. Uh, the reconquest of that. Uh, because I think they are currently fighting Genoa. And I don't want that. Well, he is taking... Are you taking down... Oh, there's no way... The Papal States actually took Genoa, and Genoa itself is down to 8k troops. The Ottomans could actually do this. I would not mind. Uh, one of my colonists is back. Let's go send them over there. Go back over here. Uh, group my troops up. Uh, the siege there is finally done. Uh, these guys. Get over here please. Uh, Portugal actually managed to get over here. And. Wow. Captured none but we sunk a lot of them. We'll get this one. Uh, yep there we go. Next one. One, two, three, and here is going to be number five for our second colonial empire. Uh, we'll let it expand by itself and we go start. Where is it that? I think it's in this region where we need to get started. Go here. We have cannons in there. Okay, let's do this differently. Get my cannons over there. Let's group you up there. It should be going a bit faster now because we got a better, a higher bonus. Ah, dispute of succession of friends, Epirus. How old? 28. Personal union of friends. Hmm. If Lithuania or Austria didn't join, I wouldn't care as much. <clears throat> uh, 
That's a very nasty fight. And we'll have to do it eventually. Okay, so there we go. It's starting. So we should get a mission done. <clears throat> Come on, take that. You better leave it be. Can we steal map still? So, if we can just manage over there, that would be great. Okay, let's deal with these troops. Uh, money, Diplo, or Manpower, or Prestige. Let's go with the uh, Diplomatic Aid. Let's go send you over there, and we'll leave the, uh, the guns, the cannons. There you go. And... One, two, three, four. The others will go after the army that we spotted. There's the fight. A uh, colo colony got damaged. Send you again. I kind of wish that you get like a notification that uh, rebels pop up there, or I did get one and I just click by it. it w I wouldn't be surprised if that is the case because I do tend to happen to to do these things where I just don't I don't read. I don't like it, I don't know where his armies are. He's probably just beelining right over here right now. Uh, Loses the build, you'll gain corruption and lose money. Let's uh, do that one. And someone has been slandering my merchants. And with that, someone is the Mamluks, of course. Well, I guess we're about to find out where those, uh, those guys went. Okay, we're at number 99, and who the hell are you, and where are you? So that's over there, I would like to take you as well, and slowly get to Kilwa. Could be that armies would go over there, but I don't think so. Let's do a tiny bit more development. There you go. Innovativeness is decreasing. So we got new cannons. So we'll take them. Ah, there we go. Let's move back. Move you over there. Let's keep moving. He should be done right now.
Uh, gain prestige or money and everybody hates me. Let's get the prestige. I don't need the money. Group you guys up. Uh, that will be blood. Let's put you on that. Detach for siege and get over to his capital. I'm sure that this is also part of his territory. you over there okay so how much could i actually take from this okay coastal regions it's what i want and didn't take that so that's a no Stuff like that. I don't want to go over a hundred. And this is actually not that bad. Sure. Let's go for it. Set those demands. We got a lot of coastal regions. Uh, we're going to be getting our overextension out of the way first. Because that's most important. Let's get all of our groups... All of our troops here on 37. That's a good time for you to be. Do we get another merchant? No. Holy war and there is of course rebels in Byzantium. Let's go. They just don't react. Now it's sad. It's sad to see that. Uh, Office become a march of Byzantium. Um, dude. No, because you suck. You have nothing. Let's go send you over there. Apparently we got a, another missionary. Okay, so this is actually going fairly good right now. So, um... Yeah, I think that's it for me, guys. That's it for the stream as well. It's almost... Um, well, it's, it's past 4 a.m. right now. Um, we did form Spain. We got some colonies up and running. Don't forget, Portugal is actually one of my guys. So once we integrate him, we'll get a lot of territory. I would like to get started on Africa because I think it's fun to be in that region. Uh, we'll just flip our troops over there. I want to go to Kilwa. And slowly work our way through the Mamluks. This army, we will have to fight the Mamluks. And we'll need to get as, as much of this maps as possible. I'm sure we can actually steal Burma. Not sure where it is. Oh, that's actually over there. Nice. That's really handy to have. That's the entire coastal region now. Once we see all of that, we can actually move everywhere. We can declare everywhere. Uh, we definitely want to keep on building that spy network. With as many as possible. And just... Wreak havoc. Wreak havoc. Go back at some point. Declare war on... Uh, Great Britain for the reconquest. Hmm... And that is actually going to be a bit sooner than I think. Denmark, 37. Lithuania, 13. And Austria, 6. Perhaps. Well, no. <sighs> Denmark will always hate me. Lithuania, we can offer him an alliance that will potentially push him out. He is allied to Great Britain, which is problematic. I kind of am a tiny bit bummed out about Burgundy that I didn't get it, but oh well, it is what it is, guys. Anyways, thank you so much for watching, all of you. Uh, I've enjoyed myself, and I hope you did too. I'll see you next time. Have a good one.
Bye bye.